what's going on everybody welcome to lump vision i go by the name lump d lump or lv it doesn't matter which one you want to call me i'll respond to any of them before i get started i'd just like to thank all of my subscribers old and new and everybody who comes by and watches my channel today i want to do a quick video i know i know i say that and sometimes a 10 15 minute video but i'm going to try my best to shrink this down really quick um i for a long time um, I've always wondered if uh, I was just doing too much, you know, beard oil, beard balm, beard butter, uh, beard jelly, beard this, beard that. Like I never used the jelly, but it just seemed like I was doing too much. And I was just basically doing the same thing over and over again um, when it comes to using products. Um, so what I decided to do is I'm going to completely cut beard oil and beard balm out of my routine, 100%. I'm running with straight beard butter for my uh, night routine and my morning routine. And the reason being is because one, like I said, I just feel like I'm doing too much. Me personally, you know, I'm doing too much and I feel like um, I, I'm kind of like wasting money and, and, and just wasting product in general. You know what I'm saying? I have a bunch of stuff, really, it could be possibly for nothing. So what I want to try to do is narrow down number one narrow down as much clutter i have in my in my uh bathroom with a bunch of products you know I, i'm a product junkie i probably once i find a way to get rid of them or you like give them away or or use them which will probably never happen i'll probably find a way to get some more stuff but i'm going to try to focus on just using beard butter only for me when it came to using products uh beard beard balm actually made my beard feel softer um, as long as well as beard butter, uh, beard oil definitely makes my beard feel soft, but I think the waxes and the butters and all that in the beard oil and beard, uh, beard, um, butter and beard balm actually made my beard feel softer than it did with oil. Um, it wasn't a huge difference, but I can definitely tell that, uh, my beard feels a little bit softer when I have butters and waxes and stuff in, um, the butter and balm. Um, so the good thing about it is you're not losing anything. The same, oil, the same carrier oils and the same essential oils that are in beard oil are going to be in the beard balm and beard butter. So I figured, let me just go in the meat in the middle. So uh, oil is the lightest when it comes to hold and consistency and all that beard butters in the middle when it comes to hold and consistency and beard balm, uh, of course, depending on which one you're using is going to be have the stronger hold and uh, thicker consistency. So beard butter is right in the middle. And I don't particularly, um, the hold aspect is not something that's a big deal to me because beard balm doesn't really make that much a difference when it comes to holding my beard, um, the shape and all that. Uh, I think because of the texture of my beard, it does a good job of doing that on its own. So does it help? Yeah, it helps, but it's not that big of a deal where it, you know, that noticeable where any little, you know, I, I got the little pricklies, little flyaways that are there. They're, they're pretty much there for the most part when I use beard balm. You know, it does help a little. So, um, but I'm going to run with this. I'm going to try anyway. It's very hard. Um, I've tried this before not to, uh, you know, just use beard butter, but to stick with one company. I've tried multiple times to stick with one company for a long period of time and I've never been able to do it. So I'm going to try to do it right now. Uh, I probably won't be sticking with one company. I'm going to stick with two companies. Um, I'm going to go with, right now I'm using Uncle Donnie's. This is the one ounce beard butter. This is the Vanilla Orchard. That's Uncle Donnie's. I'll put everything in the description box, um, website and Instagram. I went out. I didn't went out. I bought, <laughs> I bought the two ounce beard butter because I am kind of running low on the one ounce. So I bought the two ounce beard butter, Vanilla Orchard. And uh, I also have Detroit Grooming. I have Detroit Grooming. Grooming. This is a two ounce beard butter. This is Corktown. And also have um, Orchard Lake from Detroit Grooming. So at least for me, if I, if nothing else, I'll be sticking with butter. It's a, it, they're two different fields. They're two different companies different ingredients and all that, but it's still, at least I'm using butter. Uh, so like I said, it'll be really hard for me to just stick to this uh, without maybe switching it up. So that's why I'm gonna using two different companies 
and three different scents. You know, the Vanilla Orchard, both with uh, Uncle Donnie's and then the Corktown and the Orchard Lake with Detroit Grooming. So I'm going to run with that for, I don't know, maybe I'll do a month update to see where I am, but I really feel like I'm going to be okay. I feel like my skin is going to be perfectly fine. I feel like my beard is going to be perfectly fine, but the only way to find out is to give it a shot and see how it works. So that's it. Told you it's going to be quick. I hope it's quick. I don't know how long it was, but anyway, let me check out this shirt first before I go. Check out this shirt. Wife bought this for me for Christmas. So rocking it on camera. So that's it, y'all. I hope you're having a good day so far, and I hope you have a good rest of the day. And if you're having a bad day, find a way to make it good, okay? So that's it. Questions, comments, concerns, let me know later.